I'm definitely not the naturalist, most natural person on earth. Hey my boss, it's your girl Disastrous Beauty coming back with the voiceover. So this unit was a unit I caught with my own coins for the Bougie Baddies on a Budget series. So I did get this unit from Amazon and as you guys can see with the cap construction this unit does come with two cones in the front one cone in the back with adjustable straps and this is a synthetic unit and it only costs $16.99. Now I will get into more about the pricing, details, specs, all that good stuff about this unit later on in the outro. For now I'm going to go ahead and let you guys watch me style this unit and yeah I will pretty much see you guys in the outro. Bye! <laughs> Okay, y'all so I am obviously finished styling this wig and this is what I got if you are interested in the details the specs and all that good stuff about this unit then please continue to watch 
right y'all so this right here is a wig that i decided to pick out for our bougie baddies on a budget series okay so once again this is the bougie baddies on a budget okay so let me just go ahead and get into it now with this particular wig i did um get this wig obviously from amazon if you've been watching this particular series all of these wigs are coming from amazon and i just kind of want to pick out wigs from amazon that were affordable and kind of just seeing like where they at okay like how are they are they good do we like them so this particular wig is from the company ac I see a, I don't know child. I, I'm gonna have it somewhere on the screen. It says beauty short curly afro wig for black women, synthetic hair, blonde mixed gray, synthetic heat resistant afro full wig with bangs. Okay y'all, that, yeah, that's a mouthful. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna have on the screen like the details and specs that they have on here. Okay, so child. Okay, so what they have on here is like, let me just get into the color. Now you can get this wig in other colors, like team my bad for the color, but child, we'll get into that later. So the color that I am rocking is 18 um, T T0906. You can also get this wig in 1B, 230, 39A, brown, purple, T20906, T233, um, hashtag number whatever pound whatever child you can get this wig in all of these colors it says um the color that i am wearing is a blonde mixed gray it's approximately 13 inches long it's 280 grams it says two adjustable elastic straps which can fit different head size one wig one free wig cap and you know you do come it does come with the wig cap um top quality synthetic heat resistant fiber no harm to skin light weight tight very soft I was, okay so that is like the specs and stuff that they have with this wig now this wig does come with two combs and two combs on the child okay you get two combs in the front and that is it it has adjustable straps in the back as well but there are only two combs there is no comb in the back whatsoever so you just get those two combs that are in the front and there's no comb in the back now honestly i'm gonna keep it a whole buck i prefer to have a comb in the back and no combs in the front if it like if i have a choice but this wig does come with two combs in the front so i want to keep that a hundred percent with you guys um now as far as shedding and tangling with this wig i can't speak for the shedding just yet i am sure at some point this wig will shed on me but right now it is not shedding as far as tangles i do feel like with this wig it, um it's not super super tangly but i do feel like if you kind of get in there that it is a tangly wig like i kind of did pull the the hair apart but i'll get into that later but i did kind of pull the hair apart with this wig and yeah like i feel like that is pretty much it as far as um the construction now is this wig big head friendly i feel like this wig is big head friendly and i do feel like it's small head friendly i think with the adjustable straps and if you have a wig grip honey wear okay <laughs> if you have a more small if you have a smaller head i would recommend wearing your wig grip I do have on a wig grip with this wig and I did adjust the straps because right now I don't have any hair and yeah so I just the straps and I feel like with no hair my head is more small head friendly than anything so yeah keep that in mind but I do feel like this wig is big head friendly I feel like everybody can wear this wig okay so let me get into how I feel about this wig. Now, I'm not going to do a lint check because, honey, I got it pulled up. And I'm going to get into all of that, why I have it pulled up, de more details and all of that, like with the styling and how I feel about this wig. I just wanted to kind of give you guys details and specs. You guys know how I do her, okay? You know how I do this. So if you are interested in why I have it pulled up and all of that, then please continue to watch. Okay, so the first thing I want to say is that this wig is extremely inexpensive, okay? <laughs> Let me let's just go in it saying that. This wig is very inexpensive. So, with that being said, do I feel like she's worth your coins? Yes, okay? I feel like she's worth your coins because it's very inexpensive and you can get it in different colors. Now, let me tell you where I went wrong with this wig. I 
went wrong um, with this wig is in the color. Okay, I don't feel like this color is, um, is, is it doesn't look good on me. I say that because I saw a picture and the girl was more of a, a, a brown skin and I've seen it on a, a dark skin girl and I love it. I love this particular color on brown, like a, a medium brown to dark skin, like not my shade of brown, but like a, a medium brown to dark skin complexion. Looks phenomenal, okay? Phenomenal. Okay, and for some reason in my head, just because it looked good on that particular complexion, I thought it would look good on me. It doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't. Like, this is not um, friendly for my complexion. And because of that, um, yeah, I, I don't like the wig. And it's not necessarily the wig that I dislike. It's the color. I think if I got it, and I think I'm going to do it, and, and y'all, if... <laughs> If you guys want to see it, I'm gonna get that wig, this this same wig in a different color. If you wanna see that video, I'll still do it and I'll have the hair down. Um, but because it didn't look good to me on me down, I decided to do the whole pineapple thing, which is like, has become my go-to. This has become my go-to style when I'm like, ah! The hair doesn't look good on me. Like this is my new go-to style for when I don't like the way a wig looks on me. Um, I just, I feel like this color uh, definitely ages me. This is like a color, I thought it was gonna be more of an ash than a gray. Like I thought it was gonna be an ash blonde and this is like a gray blonde if there is such a thing. This is more gray than anything and I, I that just wasn't what I was expecting. And I think it's not what I was expecting because I saw it on somebody else with a different complexion and just looked phenomenal on them. And, and I'm just one of those people, I, I recognize it, girl. I, I know what don't look good on me. You ain't gotta tell me, girl, in the comments. You can tell me anyway, but I, I recognize what doesn't flatter my complexion. This is a wig that doesn't flatter my complexion. And yeah, it just doesn't look good on me because of the color, I think. Now the wig in itself, I actually like the wig. I like the wig, I like the curly afro type look. Whether you wanna wear it to like a 70s party or you just wanna wear it in general, I think that this wig is perfection, especially for the price. Like especially for the price. Now granted, there are wigs on other sites that you can get it, like uh, wig tights and all that. Like I did review a wig where I did the same style um, and it was basically the same price. The thing is, this wig is from Amazon and you won't have to pay, like, uh, I always, with wigs from wig types or from any other wig sites, I pay, I buy enough wigs where I can get free shipping. If you get this wig from, like, Amazon, obviously you don't have to buy so many to get the free shipping. You will get the shipping anyway if you have uh, Prime. You'll get free shipping anyway and it's gonna come to you faster than it would have come um, from a wig site. So that is the plus with these type of wigs. Um, God, like I got the hair so high up, you can't even see. <laughs> you can't even see it. Like it's a lot of hair. Oh, the wig I like, the wig I recommend. I styled it like this because I just didn't like how it looked on me down. I will insert a picture of it down so you guys can just see, but I just didn't like the, the look of it. And I feel like I cut so much of the hair because I was like, okay, I can get the work. I can get the look right. I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. And it wasn't the, the hair. It wasn't the hair, it was the wig. So. So like I said, that was a whole team, my bad. And you know what it is, what it is. So I ended up styling it in this little pineapple thing that I've done before. And you guys seen me do it before. If you haven't, I will insert that video. I mean, a, a card or something or in, check the description box of that video. But yeah, I, I yeah, that was, a, like I said, it was a team, my bad. It was a team, my bad. So yeah, this, this color definitely ages me and I should have gotten it in a different color, and I will. But I will say this now, honey, this color will not age everybody, honey. If you got the right complexion, girl, I, the girl that actually that's actually on the site, um, when you are on the, the cover, it looks good on her complexion. This color looks good, it doesn't age her, it ages me. It doesn't mean that it will age you, so yeah. I'm in my bag. <laughs> I'm in my bag, 
bag about this wig. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm definitely, definitely in my bag. But that's okay, girl. You know, you can't, you can't win them all. So yeah, y'all, that is pretty much it. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a full 360. Don't worry about my kitchen right here, girl. When I do my 360, don't worry about my kitchen. Worry about your own kitchen, girl. But I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a 360. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. So yeah, as I stated, it's a team my bad, but it's, this is a really affordable wig. And I, if you're looking for something, you know, like something you can throw on and it's cute and you know, whatever, I would recommend you guys checking out this wig. Um, yeah, I, I feel like this is definitely a bougie baddies on a budget type wig because it's really, really, really inexpensive. So I would still recommend you guys just checking this unit out. And yeah, y'all, that is pretty much it. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions or you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not ready to subscribe, sis, click the subscribe button. And if you're not ready to follow me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both the IG and Facebook. I'm Healthy Missy on Snapchat, and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love bugs, next time. Bye.